The EU is appearing to play a game of chicken with the UK, as the bloc readies its retaliation in the event of an Article 16 trigger. Dorks are continuing between the UK and EU over the Northern Ireland Protocol, the part of the Brexit divorce deal which avoided a hard border with Ireland. The deal effectively keeps Northern Ireland inside the EU single market for goods, resulting in some checks for products crossing the Irish Sea from Great Britain, which left the single market. Lord Frost has claimed the conditions for using Article 16 allowing parts of the deal to be suspended, have been met because of the difficulties being caused. The UK wants an end to the European Court of Justice's oversight role, something that Brussels has said is impossible. European Commission Executive Vice President Franz Timmermans told ITV's Robert Peston, I think Mr. Frost knows very well that this is not possible for the European Union. I know he knows full well that whenever the internal market is involved, the ultimate arbitrator is the European Court of Justice. But he said the European Commission had been bending over backwards to reach an agreement with the UK on the protocol. Responding to the threats of Article 16 being triggered, another Commission source told Politico, we're trying to find solutions within the process that's ongoing. If the UK focuses on Article 16 instead, they will still be faced with exactly the same questions, exactly the same challenges, exactly the same problems, the day after they trigger it. Lord Frost is expected to talk about the issue with France's Europe Minister Clement Bone in Paris today. The pair will mainly meet in an attempt to end a bitter dispute over post-Brexit fishing rights. France has threatened sanctions over what it perceives as a refusal to issue licenses to its trawlers to operate in UK waters. The UK government insisted the overwhelming majority of applications for licenses have been granted. French President Emmanuel Macron has delayed the imposition of punitive measures while talks between the UK, France and the European Commission take place. 